1番ソヨン・ウィンさん韓国Wee s e o n g had that fall on the triple it's triple toe in this short program, which is one of the reasons she finds herself ninth of the nine. She will start with that element in her free skate. Nice coverage to the double axle oiler, triple s a l c o short rotation on the triple. Two footing, the landing on the triple is a bit better than the opener. Major respect 
to Wee Soyoung. Having fallen on her opening triple loots, she came back attacking every one of the remaining 11 elements in the program. It would have been so easy to give in. I'm sure she's felt somewhat despondent to be in last place after the short. And yet she exemplifies what we can expect to see in these women. Steely determination and full of grit. She hasn't had masses of experience. This her first senior Grand Prix. And as she touches her knee, just wondering if there's been any injury leading up to the event. We have sadly been riddled with injury this season. The Japanese fans will be most notable of the withdrawal of Rika Kihira, one of Japan's strongest woman who has been sidelined with injury this season as well. Look at the edge on takeoff, she gets such a deep outside edge. But just didn't get the elevation necessary to complete rotation and land the back out on the back outside here. Luke was second element. Much better with the arm aloft and the double toe as well. We did finish sixth in World Juniors, and that's when she scored 127.85 in her free skate there. Here the Sako to see how the blade lands on the ice and continues to rotate after the topic has touched the ice. The strength and depth in the junior ranks for the women is intense. And the top 10 at junior worlds could often compete with the seniors. We'll get to see the top six juniors at the Junior Grand Prix final as well. I'm sure scores will be compatible for them as with the seniors. The total score for Soyoung Wee is 170.54.